Hello everyone. Uh, this is uh, Ostriv. Uh, now this is uh, with the Alpha 3 version. Uh, this, there's been another hotfix uh, or two since the uh, uh, last since I recorded the last part of this. So uh, you know there's been some uh, improvements. Um, anyway, uh, where we got to last time is we got a uh, farm up and running, uh, right? And we got our uh, our uh, initial residence housed. Uh, we have a forestry, a smithy, and a carpentry. Um, and we have a reforestation area where we're growing trees. So yeah, um, good. Uh, so and we have. Uh, you know, a uh, fishing dock is finished, uh, but we need a few more residents. Um, okay, we're we're finished the uh, spring uh, planting, so uh, what I'm going to do is we're going to order the uh, uh, we're going to get a boatyard worker in, and we're going to order boats for the uh, fishing dock. Okay, now let's get uh, get the uh, time progressing here. Uh, right uh, now, uh, we're also building three more houses up here uh, because we need more population. Uh, but before we uh, get too much population, we need to be able to feed them, right? Uh, and we uh, we can't do that yet until the uh, crops here come in the uh, buckwheat. And potatoes. Okay, um, and what I'm going to do ultimately is uh, I'll have a second set of fields here. I'll probably grow the same stuff on them in the same rotation once the population increases. Uh, but we also need to get the population up so we can build cow sheds, uh, chicken coops, and and so on, uh, so that the uh, the game, uh, so that uh, you know the people won't complain about lack of variety. Uh, now, uh, I've been doing some reading on the forums and so on, and it appears there's a bug in the economics, which might be why I don't understand how it works. Uh, apparently, playing on slow speed, uh, the uh, treasury payouts are lower than they should be, so you can actually make money uh, even if the uh, you're not paying out the full salaries and uh, people are uh, complaining that uh, residents are spending more money than they have now that is a uh, potential problem uh, uh, but uh, the complaint is uh, they can't spend more money than is circulating in the community that's actually not uh, so uh, so much of a valid complaint based on how money actually works. Uh, you know, these um, uh, payouts, they could easily be in, uh, say, uh, village uh, scrip, you know, some sort of a uh, local village uh, currency, right? Uh, and, you know, if it's a fiat currency, uh, more can be issued when it's needed. Uh, the key is to have enough currency in circulation to cover the uh, current transactions that are being conducted. Uh, and that in practice means needing a little bit more than you would otherwise. Uh, so, you know, th there is that. And it's not to say there isn't uh, money coming in from elsewhere, uh, say, uh, residents earning money selling stuff uh, to uh, a another. Um, a town uh, and also uh, residents could easily be buying stuff from another town uh, so yeah uh, there, there's uh, ways you could explain it but either way there does seem to be bugs in the economic sim uh, and uh, some people have reported that once your treasure goes negative you can't get positive I haven't seen that uh, that problem so I'm not sure. Now I've upped the tempo here just so that uh, things can happen. Uh, so we're, uh, you know, we're up to uh, May of 1722. So we're still early days here, but we got a house that's going to come online right away here. Uh, 
and we don't have enough workers for the boatyard. So uh, that's uh, going to be an issue until we get um, uh, until we get more people uh, in the town. Uh, hence building houses. So I'm going to queue up a few more houses. Um, right. Yeah, just like that. One, two, three, four. Um, right. Yeah, okay, so, <clears throat> oops. Uh, so four more. Uh, will uh, uh, will definitely get us to a decent level of population to support what we've got here. Um, yeah. Now what I want to do here, resource supply. Yeah, we're allowing it by cart. We're allowing it by cart. No, no, no. No, uh, no that's a forestry. These resource supply uh, will allow labor by hands as well. Uh, if we allow labor by hands, then the ladies can uh, bring supplies, and that uh, that definitely helps. Uh, resource supply, uh, yeah, will allow laborers. Uh, resource supply will allow laborers, uh, and again here. Uh, yeah, we don't have a resource supply option, and here, resource supply, yeah, we're good. Uh, right, so that's, uh, that's got uh, a, uh, a fair chunk of stuff here. Uh, apologies if there's a, a lot of noise here. Uh, the uh, thing that keeps me from being cold just kicked in. Uh, yeah, uh, and uh, it seems to be uh, creating a lot more noise than on the microphone than usual. Uh, we'll see if that uh, translates into the uh, into the video. Anyway, uh, we'll uh, keep on uh, trucking here. Uh, right. So we had another family come in. Uh, we don't have food for sale just yet, uh, so that's uh, going to be an issue uh, until the harvest comes in. Um, now, uh, what I also need to queue up here is uh, local government. I need a town hall, uh, which, um, you know, I'm going to put that here. Yeah, I definitely need a town hall, and uh, we're definitely going to need a trading post at some point, uh, which I will put. Um, I will put that. Uh, up here, maybe, no, uh, I will put that down here, uh, no, uh, right, well, yeah, that'll do. Uh, so I'll queue those up so that they, they get constructed at some point. Uh, right, so we got another house that's going up here. Uh, so we'll get a, a, another person or two in town. Uh, and we're just about to the uh, harvest stage here. Uh, that'll be in uh, the end of August, I think. Okay, so the house is up. Uh, so we got two houses available. Uh, once food is on sale, uh, we'll get uh, uh, we'll end up with uh, uh, with more uh, uh, people. 
appearing. Uh, right. So, uh, yeah, it's, uh, you know, our uh, treasury is going down, but uh, that does seem to be related to the uh, game engine. Uh, now, I, uh, I do wonder if uh, uh, the problem might not be that uh, some of the uh, stuff is timed off of uh, animations or um, uh, real time instead of uh, uh, instead of the uh, now let's uh, let those guys go do uh, something else. Uh, I wonder if it's timed off real time instead of uh, uh, game ticks or something. Uh, is it that was the case for uh, farm harvest at what at one point in an earlier version uh, where the uh, the harvest wouldn't uh, uh, you know what uh, let's fire that guy um, and that guy uh, and we'll let uh, we'll let them uh, potentially go uh, go work on the uh, the farm now yeah that's not gonna that's not gonna work so we'll we'll uh, hire that guy back okay yeah micromanaging this is probably not worth it this is going to be harvested in plenty of time uh, yeah yeah it's going to be harvested in plenty of time uh, now um, we have food for sale and jobs available so we should get a couple of uh, new families come into town uh, and that will uh, start to uh, sort out our uh, our problems right yep see we got a new family coming into town uh, probably settled here uh, yeah there's the uh, the uh, wagon coming in. Uh, there we go. So now we've got uh, another uh, worker and then there's a, a second one coming in. So yeah, uh, we're at the point where we're uh, able to start uh, expanding now. Uh, and that's actually uh, a pretty uh, pretty important point in the game. You need to make sure your population is high enough to support your industry. Uh, right. Uh, okay, well the harvest is done. Let's hire our builders back. And then uh, these guys can uh, get built. Uh, okay, so how's the uh, the harvest? So we're gonna have uh, yeah a fair bit of stuff there. Uh, we definitely need to get the trading post up so we can get uh, get some more iron. Um, although the smithy has a fair bit of it stored up, so you know we're probably okay there. Yeah, probably. Uh, okay, we're producing the boats. Um, yeah, well, we won't be getting any fishermen up this uh, uh, this uh, season, uh, but next season we'll hire some, and then we'll be uh, we'll be good. Uh, right. Uh, this here. Okay, that. Uh, that house is going to go go up uh, real quick now. Then uh, the well will get built. Yeah. Okay. So we're good here. Um, the harvest is just about done. Yep. Okay. So that's good. Uh, so the uh, the house will now go up. So isn't that uh, just, uh, 
let's slow that down we can watch the guys build the house here you know this uh, this is an amazing thing that uh, the uh, developer has done here yeah sure they're walking through things uh, and it's uh, you know kind of simplistic but you know uh, stuff actually uh, you know gets done you can see the uh, the villagers uh, you know doing it though of course once you've uh, watched it a couple of times you know it's just oh look they're building a house you know okay now let's uh, get back to the view that I normally use uh, so we'll end up with uh, the next um, the next family that comes in will um, will definitely uh, fill in our current jobs market. There we go. So we should get a family for that one. Okay. Yep. Uh, then the uh, well will get uh, built and then four more houses. And then I think we'll have enough people to support the fishing industry. Yep, our third boat is being delivered. Um, okay, so we've got basically full employment now. Right, so once uh, once these houses are up and city hall is, you know, the town hall is up and the uh, trading post is up, let's move the trading post ahead of the uh, town hall. Uh, okay, so the uh, well is completed up there. Uh, so how's drinking water doing? It's going up, so that's good. Right. Um, now, um, uh, what I should probably do while I'm thinking about it is build a uh, cemetery, uh, which I'm going to put. Okay, I'm going to do that by. Uh, we'll take a big arch and we'll put that here. No, we'll put that here. Uh, yeah, like that. And uh, I'm, I need to uh, do this so I can get the uh, get the uh, angle right for what I want to do here okay come on there there we go I'm holding alt to keep that from snapping uh, but you can't click and but I can't click when it's when alt is on so okay so I'm gonna build two of these here whoops and I'm going to pause the building of these well actually I don't need to because they're um, uh, they're uh, at the back of the queue okay uh, so we got another house up, so we'll get another family will arrive. Now, uh, I need to uh, get fences. So I'm going to put a fence from here uh, to here and here. And then I'm going to uh, get another fence, which will... 
Uh, come on, I need it to snap here. Yep. And I need to bring it up to here and then to here. Okay, so this is going to be the, uh, the cemetery. So now, um, religion, burial plot. I will go up here and I'll put uh, several of uh, these in. Uh, that was eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Uh, and I'll put two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, uh, uh, nine, 10, 11, 12. So that's 24 burial plots. Keep pressing escape to uh, exit things, but you know, it just, it just doesn't uh, work. So uh, we're good until 24 people die. So we've got a space left aside for that. Uh, so we should be good there. Uh, right. You know, I was reading comments on Steam uh, the people were talking about, well, it's like uh, five years into the uh, game and I've only had like one person die in the village. Well, you know, keep in mind that uh, with a population of, say, 50, uh, the odds of uh, anybody dying on any given year is relatively low. So, yeah, it's not surprising that a few years you wouldn't have anyone die. Uh, Okay, that's another house up. Uh, so we got three houses in. We'll probably have uh, families come in in the spring. Uh, so what I'm going to do though, I'm going to hire some uh, fishermen. Uh, yeah, because uh, we definitely want to have uh, fish. Uh, so now there's jobs available so people might come. Uh, so you can see here, I've used the placement of these things here to create a sort of uh, street uh, system there. Uh, and that's, uh, that's, uh, that's intentional. Uh, okay, so we've got another family coming in. And I think we'll have another two after that will come. Uh, okay, so we've got our fishermen queued up. Uh, having uh, fish come in uh, will help with the uh, food variety problem, and that will uh, definitely uh, uh, make the village run better. Uh, right, yeah, obviously you can't fish in the winter. Um, Right, so after these two houses come up, the trading post gets built, uh, which uh, takes rather a lot of stuff to build, uh, but we have the resources. Once that goes up, I'll hire a manager there, and then we'll potentially be able to import some stuff that we need. Uh, one of the things we'll need to import is uh, more iron. Okay, so we're up to 41 residents. Um, I think, yeah, in the in the spring when the field planting starts up, there'll be job demand, uh, and that should bring uh, that should potentially bring uh, more uh, uh, more families in. So right now we're basically at a uh, waiting stage. Um, let's just uh, check in on these trees here. Yeah, so they're uh, they're growing nicely.
Right. Uh, okay. So we got another house is just about done here. Uh, and that'll be in time for planting season. Yeah, there we go. Uh, so now we've got three empty houses. Okay, and we've got the food variety thing popping up again. So, um, yeah, we still got plenty of food uh, stored. So well, that's mostly stored in the farm. So yeah, we're, we're gonna need um, uh, we're gonna need a granary, um, which uh, I think can go right here yeah definitely uh, it can go right there and uh, then we'll store the potatoes and buckwheat in there um, we probably want a warehouse as well um, where we're going to store uh, things like iron Okay, so we'll add those to the queue. Uh, they're less critical, but we'll definitely add them to the queue. Uh, looks like that uh, fourth uh, house will go up uh, before planting season starts. Uh, it'll get pretty close anyway. Uh, and there's the uh, snow melt. Uh, that's kind of trippy uh, when you're looking at it like this. Uh, right. Now oh, this is going to take a moment. Okay. The uh, yeah, that's definitely going to be uh, basically done. Okay, we've got the uh, uh, we've got oh, we've got one field already sown. Okay, uh, and we've got uh, people coming. Uh, I'm going to bring this up to five slots because then uh, uh, when uh, other when one fisherman is resting another can be uh, uh, can be fishing uh, right okay we got another family coming in And that uh, house is going up. Okay, so we've got... Uh, yeah, we've got a population that's growing. Yep. And we're going to have fish coming in. Which, are we selling fish? We are. Okay. Yeah, we're good there. Uh, so I'm gonna I'm gonna need to get a cow shed operational relatively soon, but I'm gonna hold that for the uh, next season at least. I need these uh, these building this building queue to, to drain. Um, yeah. So now uh, this here should be uh, con should be getting constructed. Uh, it should go up pretty quickly due to proximity of the raw materials. Oh, it just needs wood and clay, uh, mostly. Okay, so yeah, uh, and I think I'm going to need another uh, cart shed. Yeah, put it here. And we'll build that next. Okay. Um, yep, that's... Uh, yeah, that's going to go up pretty quick. So uh, we'll potentially be able to get our first uh, imports up uh, pretty quickly.
Uh, good. Now we've got here. Yeah, we're uh, accumulating fish now. So uh, there's that. Yeah, so we should be okay for the for the most part here. Um, yeah. Okay, the uh, farm's operating. Uh, right. Okay, so clay has come in here. Uh, what I'm going to do is hire a couple more builders. Uh, let's see how quickly we can uh, clear the queue. Um, yeah. Uh, so that's yeah, that's going to go up a lot faster now. Okay, yeah, now it's building. Uh, and we got a new family coming in because I opened up uh, job slots. And we'll probably get the one more and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll, be, uh, we'll be good there. Um, yeah, so once this is uh, up, yeah, yeah, there's the uh, other family. So now our uh, existing housing is full. But it also means that we have uh, we have quite a bit of uh, uh, operational uh, stuff here uh, getting done. Uh, you know, I'm going to uh, drop a couple of the uh, builders now. Uh, yeah, uh, drop one more. Uh, yeah. Okay. So here's our uh, trading post. Uh, we need a manager there for sure. Um, yeah. And uh, we're also going to allow uh, laborers to supply things. Uh, cart parking. We'll order the carts. Uh, right. Uh, now. Uh, town hall is being made. Uh, so I'm going to put a permanent two permanent worker slots open there. Uh, yeah. And yeah, so that's filled. Uh, now what have we got here? So we're up to 50 fish, so that's good. Right. Um, okay, yeah, that's gonna, going to uh, finish pretty quickly. Uh, Yeah, it's good. they're going to start actually building it. Yeah, there it goes. Uh, yeah, uh, so when the town hall is up, uh, this uh, camp center tent will um, will drop, and then we'll be able to uh, play around with the stuff in the uh, uh, economy settings. But I'll save that for the uh, the next uh, episode. Uh, right. Yep. There we go. There's the uh, town hall. And now the mayor is uh, working there. Right. Now, 
Um, yeah, yeah. I'm going to drop back to uh, two builders now, and uh, what I'm going to do is, uh, you know, switch things back, uh, you know, to. Um, where, where was I going to switch things back? Oh, wait, we got a... Um, we can buy honey. Actually, that might be a good thing to pick up. Uh, that'll help with uh, food variety. Uh, so we'll uh, make sure to sell that. Uh, here we go. There it is. Uh, good. Uh, right. Uh, oh no no, I I didn't turn off the uh, extra work slots there. Okay. Uh, good. Uh, so what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to leave off the part here, and uh, we'll get on with um, a further town development. Uh, uh, maybe getting started with uh, cattle. Uh, in the uh, in the next part so uh, you know stay healthy and see you back uh, probably next uh, next Friday for the next part anyway uh, that's all for now